Hello everyone. In this video, we're going to explore a game uh, called 3D Paintball uh, using Star Logo Nova, the uh, programming environment created by uh, the MIT uh, Scheller Teacher Education Group. Uh, what I want to show you is how the uh, game uh, works. Here you have created some blocks uh, and spread them in 3D. Your player is uh, able to move in a 3D environment, as you can see here, move forward, turn, etc. Um, and what you're able to do with the player is um, have uh, the player shoot some um, paintballs. And the aim of the program, the aim of the game, could be simply to uh, basically color the um, the ball, uh, the the blocks that you see. So here you see uh, some. And you notice that in a fairly simple game programming uh, setup, you're able to create some pretty uh, interesting. Uh, three-dimensional uh, environments. And I want to quickly show you the kind of coding that is uh, behind this. Uh, here you see the code for the paintball. Uh, again, the pieces fit together like a puzzle. Uh, and here is the code for the world. It's not terribly long code. Uh, and uh, my estimation is probably uh, under I don't know, 50, 60 lines of code, you're able to create a pretty uh, convincing and pretty exciting um, uh, game environment. And here, actually, you have other controls that you can uh, decide what to do. For example, the number of blocks, you could say, I want the number of blocks to be much more, so it's much denser or much less, uh, much less dense. Uh, you could also decide, let's actually have a little bit more blocks, uh, you could also decide that uh, your um, uh, main character is going to move at a fast speed or at a uh, slow speed. So here's a fast speed uh, version of that, you can see. And uh, you could create some really exciting... Uh, uh, scoring schemes, etc. All right, uh, the purpose of this was to just give you some ideas about uh, the things you could do in Star Logo. I hope you will take the time to explore uh, some of these ideas. All righty, take care.